Are you looking for ways to make your meetings more engaging, more interesting, and just frankly easier to follow along? Hi, I'm Kim Barnes. And I'm Mike Barnes. Zoom now has a function kind of like closed captioning. It's live transcription. It doesn't cost extra to get it. And it puts words on the screen. And what's great is that you don't have to use a third party to do it now. You can do it just within Zoom. So as the host, I'm going to look for this button that says live transcript. I click on it. And now I will have to have clicked on something within the settings before I join the meeting. But once I'm in the meeting, I'll look for this. I'll enable auto transcription and voila, there you go. The host turns on the live transcription, but it doesn't affect the attendee until you click it yourself. You have that same function at the bottom of your screen, then you click it and now you see it yourself. There it is. Now it's not always perfect, right? <laughs> No, it's not. If you have a little bit of an accent or if you talk too fast, if you say Bernstein Media real fast, then it may say Bernstein Media. You know, it's not going to be perfect, but it helps a lot, especially in a long meeting. So if you are in a situation where it's really important that all the words be very precise, then you might still need to use a third party, but this sure comes in handy. And another feature that you can do is next to the live transcript, you have the option to view the full transcript and you can pull it over to the side. You can have have it up on the screen so that you can see it as the meeting goes along. Another thing you can do is you can adjust the settings. So the subtitle settings, if I need to maybe make the font size a little bigger, I can, which is handy. And when you do that, it only affects you. So when Kim makes her font size bigger, mine stays the same size. I have to adjust mine for me. So if you want to give this a try and hopefully make your Zoom experience even better, it's free in Zoom. Another great tip from Barnes Team Media.